Hi there, Leo. Thank you for joining me for your March forecast. As the month begins on the 2nd, so Mercury, the planet of communication, moves into a more exploratory part of your scope. From then through to the 11th, you've got a great opportunity to investigate travel, higher education, or just new interests. However, from the 12th onwards, Mercury does begin the first of its three retrogrades that occur each year. And through to the 23rd, it is going to be twisting backwards in an area which can have a big impact on your travel plans or anything to do with contracts. If you are moving around or having big discussions during this period, you may need to be really careful. Keep your wits about you. And if you're on the move, then certainly tune into the weather and travel reports and to make sure that anything to do with the transport system, any news about it, is something that you're really across. Now it is true to say that on the 5th, Venus, the planet of love, does move right to the top of your horoscope. The suggestion is that from then through to the 17th, someone influential can have an enormous bearing on your situation and you could enjoy a huge stroke of fortune. This could see you making your way up the ladder of success in a way which you just never could dream would have been possible. It could be just a complete stroke of fortune, or it may be linked to something you've been working hard on for a very long time. But your relationship with people, particularly your superiors, does have a chance to shine. You've a natural magnetism anyway, and most Leos can draw a lot of attention their way without even trying. But you're going to be supercharged in this regard at that part of this month. Now, it is true to say that on the 20th, the sun moves into your sister fire sign of Aries. And that once more can connect you to the thought of opening up your world. But it's possible that if it is linked to your career, you may be traveling in order to further your interests. Even if it doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to stay overnight, you may commute to a job that really does meet your expectations. But then towards the end of this month, Mars, which is moving backwards all of the month, suggesting you need to be cautious about how you handle your finances, even if you have any good luck. Well, that does go face to face with Neptune, and you need to watch out in the last two days of March for someone who could be pretty devious when it comes to a deal, and you need to make sure that your ethics and motives are squeaky clean as well across these two days. Thank you for joining me. Good luck, and goodbye for now.